Voters have denied the Cass Lake Bina School District a bonding referendum which would have built a new elementary school. Uh, Josh Peterson shares with us how the school district plans to reevaluate its plans now. The results of Tuesday's election will send the Cass Lake Bina School District back to the drawing board. Voters overwhelmingly voted down a $37.8 million referendum that would have built a new intermediate elementary school for grades 3 through 5 and renovate its current building for pre-K through second grade. For the school district, the results came as a complete surprise. It truly was a surprise. We thought that we would uh, do much better. We actually really believed that this referendum would pass, so it was really a great surprise to us at the number, um, the percentage of no votes. The vote failed by a wide margin of 442 votes to 144. Now the school district is left to reevaluate its plans and how to maintain its current structure and programming. You know, because the referendum didn't pass doesn't mean that the that the needs go away. So we're going to have to just regroup, take a look at uh, maybe some possible reasons why it was such a high percentage of the no vote. With the results of the referendum now in, it's back to the drawing board for the Cass Lake Bina School District, meaning staff here at the elementary school may have to get creative. Elementary school principal Joshua Grover says that changes will need to be made in order to accommodate a growing number of incoming students. Well, it's going to force us to be a little bit creative in our, in our thinking, in our handling of, of the physical environment, um, in our personnel, trying to figure out where we can put children. The school also faces challenges of wait lists for students and trying to provide a space for all Cass Lake Bina children. We have a profound need to get kids the things they need educationally um, early on in their education. And if they don't get that, um, we're finding you know, less success. Overall, the school district says they will continue to move on and maintain the very best services they can offer its students. In Cass Lake, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. And in the Pillager School District, a bonding referendum to build elementary school classrooms and an auditorium also failed. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.